like a little. <sighs> okay. Pandemonico. The healer. Where you're supposed to be? Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna do like a little announcement. Um, you're gonna give your thoughts about it. And then, and yeah. And then you can leave. I'll continue the video. Okay, funny shot. <laughs> okay. <coughs> we have the little thing. Okay, ready? What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Finally, I am getting to record a video. It's been such a long time that I feel like, what am I supposed to say? Oh my god, I feel so nervous. But today's video is an exciting video. It's the opening of a series here on my YouTube channel and I'm super excited to share guys with you guys this news. That's why I have my husband. For those of you who don't know, this is my husband. You must know. He's like always in like all up in my stuff. So, <laughs> yes. Say hello! <laughs> Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. No, you're not supposed to do that. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hi. So as you guys can see, are you guys reading what the news is? If you guys follow us, uh, follow me on Instagram, you already know that I posted the picture that we are expecting our third child. <gasps> Three. My God, so scared. Oh my God, I heard it. I heard it right now, and it kind of like I think it's sinking in. Uh, about time! Oh my god, I heard Get it! Get there faster! <laughs> oh my god, third child! How are we gonna do this? Um, I don't know. I'm gonna leave. I'm actually He's leaving. leaving. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a plane to oh, Spain. You guys, it's recorded. He's leaving. <laughs> no, so, I'm kidding. We actually have two boys, yes. um, nine and four. And then I guess it was time for the third one so they can be four years, almost four years apart. I think we waited a little too long for the third child. For this one. Yeah, I think we were just kind of scared. You were scared. I think that we we were all, you know, we were thinking that, that we were all set with two. You know, we, I think that we never, like doing those four years, we never thought about having a third child. I mean, I always had it in the back of my head, like what if we get a little girl? Like I always had it in the back of my head, but all these people having babies all around it's us, it got contagious and I said, baby, I think it's time for another child. I, I think so too. So, well, you can have one, I can have one. It's like a lollipop. No, no, no. Well, go for it. Go for it. I don't mind. <laughs> so the stick don't lie. I don't know if you guys can see it. You guys won't probably see it. The stick don't lie. Well, um, it's kind of funny because um, she did it in the morning. She took the pregnancy test, test, and she was sleeping. I was like, "Did you did the, the pregnancy test?" And she was like, "Yeah, I did, but it's negative." You know, you have you have two lines and no, I said it's negative. It's negative. And I yeah. showed you the. So I, I I was like, where is the where is the test? And she's like, it's in the in the garbage can. And I'm like, okay, let me look at it. And I grab it and I was like, babe, you're pregnant. And she was like, no, I'm not. <laughs> I was like, I am not. And I'm like, there's one line. And then he's like, no, there's two lines. Well, look, it's visible. You guys can. I don't know if you guys. Let me do it like you guys do. Hey, you know, you this brush. There we go. Uh, Baby, it's focusing me. You see the little square? Look for the square. There. I'm looking for the square, but it's there, not. It there you go, there you go. There you go. What happened? It's focusing me. There you go. There you go. There we go. Yeah. There, there you go. It, it looks. It has two it lines, two right? Lines. It has two lines, but I saw one like really, really dark, and I'm like, babe, it's just, I guess it just kind of picked up, and I think it's just one line. And then he's like, no, babe, you're pregnant. Uh, so I took the other pregnancy <laughs> test, and it was positive. And it was the same. So I called my kids over. We're like, any yeah, so I come over? How many lines? And they're like two. And I'm like, how am I the mother, the one that's pregnant, and only saw one line? That's crazy. It was crazy. It was so funny, you know, we started laughing and, <laughs> and you know it's it's kinda it's kinda good, you know, because we start this pregnancy laughing and yeah and you know enjoying it, you know. I think that uh, it's a blessing. It's a blessing it to is. have three kids, you know, it's a blessing to have It's gonna a child. be hard. Yeah, it is. But it's gonna be worth it, honestly speaking. So we decided to go to the doctors, um, to get everything like 
completely sure so we went to two doctors the first doctor did a pregnancy test on my urine again and he said it's positive you're pregnant i'm like okay so i am pregnant there's a little human being growing inside of me oh my god this is sinking in right now and i'm scared <laughs> and then we ended up going to my other doctor like two days ago for the sonogram so guys <laughs> listen to this we're at the doctor. But by the way, this is the doctor that that yeah. had bring both of our kids. Yeah, this is my gynecologist that brought both of my kids. So we went back to him, and he said, "Oh, it's take. It took you guys too long." I'm like, "What the hell? Why do people think that you can just pop babies out of your vajayjay like nothing?" <laughs> so we ended up going back. <laughs> he did the ultrasound, and he's like, "You guys, there's like two little um." like sacks in there and he measured both of them and he's like could it be no first when he walked in the room he said what if it's twins and they're both girls and my husband's like haha shut up <laughs> so we ended up doing the sonogram and he said that he saw two little sacks and they both measure the same thing but he said listen we're not like i'm not a, a like a expert on sonograms so let's go to a go to a tech that nice. knows what to do because as far as I'm concerned I see two so we left the office like this no it was it was such a like scary moment like it was like I was so nervous about yes. it like you know because you know you're ready for one more you know we we were you know trying to get one more but two is like eh, you know and, and we were thinking about moving about buying a minivan and you know all that stuff you know at the same time you know and it was like <gasps> it's a little tough because we live in an apartment that's three bedrooms so right now my recording studio slash office is going to be transformed into half the nursery half my stuff that's a process that i'm going to share with you guys here on this series so um we, he was like you need to book this appointment today so it was like 3 30 he started calling um, some, I started calling the other one. He was able to get one, it was like 45 minutes away from my house. And it was actually at 45 minutes. And I was like, babe, I don't think we're gonna make it. He's like, we're gonna make it. So we made it. We, we had to drink a lot of water first. I had to drink 32 <laughs> ounces of water before without peeing. I was just gonna die. I was like, I, there's no way I can drink so much water in less than an hour. So we ended up getting there, we ended up doing the sonogram. And um, in fact, there is just one. Woo! We were able to breathe. I was like, oh my god. Well, by the way, it doesn't mean that if we have two, you know, it wasn't gonna be different, you know? <laughs> yeah, it, it was gonna be different in the beginning, like, you know, like, economically speaking and stuff like that, but the love of, you know, to our child is gonna be the same, you know? It was Even a little, it was gonna be, it was gonna be challenging. It was gonna be challenging, but I think that, you know, a kiss is a blessing. Anyways, you know, if God have blessed us with with two it just it just lets imagine let's two inside this body well yeah god you know. knows what he's doing two inside this body my two boys were really hard enough and there was just one imagine two but guys there's only one if you can see it it's a really tiny little tiny thing right right here wait right there. it's right get there. off of the camera right you see that little tiny Whoa. thing right there that's the little tiny thing. So, according to my first guido uh, sonogram, I was seven weeks, but according to this, the tech, it says that the baby's five weeks uh, inside. So it's really, really tiny. So cute, guys. So <clears throat> we, I don't know, we're hoping for, whatever it is, I just want it to be um, healthy. A healthy pregnancy and a healthy baby. Mm -hmm. He wants a boy. Well, it's easier boys are easier he's Way scared easier. of the girls yeah you know just that i know that is if a girl break the hearts of my kids you know they will cry but they're boys you know i will be like come on man move forward you know it's just, it's a little curious outside you know you know how many hearts you broken a big fat zero. whatever so it's called karma like get over what? it <laughs> <laughs> why do you want that to happen to no you? because you just you just yeah, you'll you'll probably feel what it is to you know like damn I, I used to be that type of guy. And have That's why I don't want a girl. Exactly, because you know he was bad. I wasn't that bad. You broke my heart. <laughs> so you didn't life. pay attention to me at first. <laughs> well you did serve it. You told me oh, I'm gonna move to Florida. I'm what like, okay, I'll just go. Whatever. <laughs> so we're excited guys. I know it's not gonna be easy and it's gonna be a little tough road, but we're ready. Um we pray for it. 
We pray that God blesses this um, pregnancy, blesses this child, and uh, we're ready for what's to come. And I'm excited to gain those 30 pounds the doctor said I needed to gain. Yeah. I don't know if that's gonna happen. <laughs> All right, so you can leave now. I'll continue uh -huh. the video. Say bye. Bye, bye Felicia. He has to eat. He has yeah. to go to work. I go to work and pick up my youngest son. He's gonna be the youngest or he's a middle child. That's gonna be the middle little. Middle little. So let's do it. Bye guys, thank you for your support and God bless you all. Okay? Bye. Move out of my video. I'm just kidding. Thank you, babe. I love you. I love you, babe. Bye. Bye. All right, guys. So really quick before we finish this video, I just wanted to share with you guys what you guys will be expecting throughout this series. I think I'm gonna name this your mommy to be. Um, I want to share with you guys everything on my pregnancy. I know you guys have said on my Instagram, if you guys commented and sent me the message, said, "Oh my God, I can't wait to follow your journey and whatever." And I really want to document as much as I can with you guys on camera. Um, given the fact that my other two pregnancies were very, very hard, I want to make sure that. I want to be able to be very healthy in this pregnancy because like I said, I wanted to share with you guys the most I can of this pregnancy. Um, given the fact that it's my third child, I come with a little more experience as to what we need, what we need to buy, how to pack a diaper bag, how to pack for the hospital, all these things. But yeah, I'm going to share that with you if you're still going to be a first time mom, if you're thinking of uh, having a child. I'm so stuffy. If you're thinking about having a child, all that, hopefully this series I can share what I know with you guys and hopefully it will motivate you to finally have that child that you're wanting. Um, you can pray on it. God does everything for a reason, for a purpose. So I want to share here in this series, Mom to Be. Um, like food tips, fashion tips, because just because you're pregnant and you're carrying a child doesn't mean you need to let go of yourself. I think that pregnancy is one of the beautiful, um, the most beautiful stages of a woman, and I feel like she needs to like own it. Like you don't. Sometimes you're gonna feel like you don't want to dress up, which is totally normal. But I just want to let you know that because you're growing a child inside of you doesn't mean that you need to let go of yourself like that's definitely not it so i will be sharing with you a lot of tips a lot of um finds um the transformation of the room i'm going to be short sharing with you guys because like i said i divided half and half is going to be half my office my recording and then half over here is going to be the nursery so i'm going to be sharing that with you as well so i'm super excited for what it is to come i'm going to be doing a first trimester a second trimester and a third trimester video for you guys so as far as right now i am five weeks pregnant and let me tell you <sighs> The nauseous and the morning sickness are starting to come through. And I'm like, listen, you need to go back to where you came from, okay? So, but I'll be sharing with you everything. So, if you guys want to be part of this journey, um, I invite you to come along. I invite you to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss anything. And turn that notification bell on so when these videos pop up, you're ready to watch. So, guys, thank you so much. If you guys want to continue following me, I will be also posting pictures. I also will be posting blog posts. So, follow me on my Instagram account right down there. And also on my blog right on the description box. So, thank you guys so much. Thank you guys for your love and your support. If you like this video and you are excited as we are, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. And thank you guys for sticking till the end. Muchas besos. I'll see you ladies on my following video. Adios.